Hello friends, thank you for stopping by for today's nugget. The new covenant has a better mediator. The Tuesday lesson asks a very important question. Why is Jesus a better mediator of the covenant? The meaning of the word mediator in Greek derived from the word middle, one who walk and stand in the middle. The term referred to a person who fulfilled one or more of the following an arbiter between two or more parties, a negotiator, or a business broker. The word can also mean a witness in the legal sense of the word. And or finally, one who stands as a surety and thus guarantees the execution of an agreement. Jesus is not conceived as a mediator in the sense that he settled dispute between the Father and humans, or a peacemaker who reconciled parties in disaffection or as a witness who satisfies the existence of a contract. Instead, as Hebrews explained, Jesus is a guarantor, a surety of the new covenant. Jesus is the greater mediator than Moses because he ministers in the heavenly sanctuary. He has offered himself as a perfect sacrifice for us. Moses' face reflected the glory of God, but Jesus is the glory of God. Moses spoke with God face to face, but Jesus is God's word personified. Jesus serves in a better sanctuary. He has a better ministry directly tied to a better covenant and based on a better promise. Jesus is the surety of the new covenant. Because of his sacrifice, we can come boldly to the throne of grace and find grace in our time of need. Whatever your need may be today, come to the throne of grace. Bring our needs to God through prayer because God has promised to hear and bless. Thank you for stopping by. Study your lesson and see you tomorrow. <music>